Division 2 here. Onslaught Deathmatch. Yeah. Need to find two more players. Come on. Come on. One more player. One more player. One more player. All right. Here we go. What are we playing? Team Deathmatch on Containment. Not having it in the Game Caviar Lounge. Bringing you an Game Caviar production. It is. And it's been a while. But Sony just dropped the almighty firmware update that allows people like me to use my HD PVR to make videos again. And along with making videos, I'm using the, uh, what is it, Stream Easy uh, software from Hopage. And that allows me to make a live calm, just like I did before, uh, right before the PlayStation 4 came out. Uh, it's been a while. It has been a while, but I'm glad that I'm back at it. You know, I'm definitely glad. And right before I started making videos again, I decided to make all new Game Caviar videos ad free, which means as soon as you click on a video, it's going to play. You don't have to worry about ads. You don't have to worry about that. Wait five seconds for the video or the ad to skip it. Or if they force you, heaven forbid, they force you to actually watch like a 30 second video. That was suck. But uh, it happens. And I don't want my peeps going through that. So I'm not going to monetize any new gaming videos until further notice. And further notice means if I like all of a sudden become unbelievably popular and I lose my job, I'm going to need that extra money. I hope you understand. But now I don't see I, I don't foresee that happening. Oh my god! <sighs> you know they just announced the uh, Call of Duty Advanced Warfighter or Warfare, or whatever the hell it's called. I hope that's not in there because I don't know whether it's like some sort of <sighs> I don't know whether it's some sort of continuing joke with the makers of Call of Duty, but you should not be able to run through bullets in kill somebody to death with a knife they honestly they should go the way of uh what is it dice did with battlefield and how you have a chance to block a melee from the front um when when you're playing battlefield 4 you know i mean if somebody tries to if somebody melees you from the front now you have a chance to first of all it wasn't a like one thing uh, from the front. Now, if they snuck up from behind you, yeah, you're, you're screwed because they're going to kill you and take your dog tag. But it used to be uh, more than one hit to kill somebody with the uh, with the knife in Battlefield. But now you have the chance as the as the person getting melee. I don't know whether there's like an official term for that. Is it the may the melee? <laughs> the other person, the meleeer? I don't know. But yeah, you have a chance to uh, block the attack, and you can stab them with their own knife, and then you take their dog tag. I wish they would incorporate something like that into the next Call of Duty game, because the makers of Call of Duty are not ashamed to steal ideas from other companies. So uh, they definitely need to take the good ideas and incorporate them into their games which they can definitely do i like the idea of the advanced warfare uh, the video that they have it was amazing as it should be i mean it would really suck if they they had the reveal video and it was you know really bleak and boring uh kevin spacey is going to be involved in the the game i guess he's going to be the man and the main antagonist what just happened there what was that is this the same guy that killed me earlier? Come on. Anyway, uh, he shot me. He shot my legs to death, and and that's what killed me. Um. Uh. Anyway, yeah, Kevin Spacey's involved in it. He's uh, a really great actor. Uh, the guy can really do some good. Um. Uh. What is it? Impersonations too. Uh. Believe it or not, but. Uh, on back on subject. The, the game looks very interesting. It's coming out in November, uh, which is usual for 
Call of Duty. Sledgehammer is making it now. Sledgehammer helped Infinity Ward, the makers of Call of Duty Ghost on Modern Warfare 3, a game that not many people really... Uh, really, a lot of people criticize Modern Warfare 3, but I liked it. I, I didn't really like it that much at first, but I came to like it, especially... What was that? Especially after uh, playing Black Ops 2, because I despised Black Ops 2, but uh, Sledgehammer really seems to have a grip on the the game, and it it looks like they're going to make a really good product. So at the beginning of November, we will see probably before then, because yeah, as with any other call of duty game, somebody's going to get it and they're going to upload videos of online because that's what people really care about is the online component. I myself included. Wow. You just eat bullets in this game. That's it. I normally, I've been playing hardcore, for a very long time because of the simple fact that I don't like shooting people nine million times uh, but this is not hardcore obviously but anyway Call of Duty Ghosts we gotta be pretty bad here uh, PlayStation 4 Game Caviar Studios a lounge it's a lounge now now it's a lounge it started off as a studio but now it's a lounge I'm not having it oh man I really wanted to do better than that uh, whatever I'm out.